I know this is absolutely gonna mess with my head. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of chair swings at all, and this is 450 feet in the air. I can tell you now, it's already getting windy, and it's already getting me. I'm just checking my pockets to make sure I haven't forgotten anything, because you uh, cannot get, uh, you, you're not allowed to put anything on to this ride. And I don't even know why I'm trying to speak to you, because it's so loud. Wow. Exhilarating as well at the same time. Wow. You can see absolutely everything in the Orlando area from up here. You can even see Disney World, the Universal, there's Volcano Bay in the distance. Well, yeah, more. You can see um, Fun Spot Orlando. Wow. What a view from up here. It absolutely is it's getting me there in the stomach and the heart. Wow. you up here. <laughs> but that's the end of our cycle and we're going back down. Welcome we are. Oh, it's so oh. Here we go, back on the Orlando Starflyer. Oh, you can see Bush World, um, Sea World over there. Yep, you can see Sea World, which we were actually at today, weren't Volcano we? Volcano It was fun, Bay. Volcano Bay, yeah. Woo, here we go. Back I around. I keep missing the contemporary. Oh, do you? Where is it? Wee! Where is it? Uh, wow. I missed it again. Like... This is quite thrilling because this is like, can get up to what was it? Like, I what did you read? About 60 miles 60, per hour? 60, I think. Wow. Ooh, it is so windy up here. Oh, wow. Look at everything. Right at the top now. Wow. If you, if you look around, yeah. you get really disorientated. You're like, oh. Oh yeah, I just looked to my right and that is weird. <laughs> Whee! Yeah, we're going to have to get a night ride on this, aren't we? Yeah, Icon is, yeah. Like Amber said, Icon is just lit up. It looks fantastic. This is going to look fantastic at night as well. Yeah. 
But I drive, what a fantastic location. There's a sky swing over there. However, the largest sky swing in Orlando is over there. No, thank you. No, no, it is <laughs> no, that one actually, no, yeah. No, thank you. Wow. Whoa, that is making my legs go funny. What an experience this is. Making our way back down. Making our way downtown. Yeah, that's right, we are going back down to the ground on the absolutely incredible Orlando Star Flyer. You absolutely, anytime you come to Orlando, you have to come on this. Probably one of the most exhilarating experiences that you can have in Orlando. It's very scary. But it's no very scary, but yeah, do not let it put you off. It almost put me off, yeah. but I committed to it, and I'm so glad I did, because, well, this is my third go now. Oh, and it is fantastic. I was terrified before, but you will love it after you've done it. And we don't like heights. So. Yeah, I don't like heights at all. We Amber doesn't like either. But the this this will conquer great, one of those fears. Like the views you get are great of Disney, yeah. Universal, like Volcano Bay, SeaWorld. Yeah. Great view. Well, fantastic. That was so much fun. And we will be getting another nighttime POV of this. Oh, wow. Absolutely brilliant. All right. Once we stop, we'll be descending. Oh, looks like uh, we got a little uh, friend joining us. And there he is. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Whee! Here we go, Night Nighttime. Oh, it's Twin Peaks. It's a good show, that. Right, what's the stage is that? No. to the steakhouse. There's two right next to each other. Whee! Oh, Icon! Dare to ride? Icon! Dare to ride! Where's Space Mountain? about looking down. You see it? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, <my God>. <laughs> Who? Track Silverstone.
And that was Alex performing Hot Hot Hot. <laughs>